This video will show you how to configure the relay 1, 2, and 3 of the ATV 630 and 930 drives. From your main menu, you want to scroll into menu 5, complete settings. Once you have entered in, you want to scroll down into 5.11 inputs and outputs menu. Once you have entered in, you want to go ahead and hit the fourth tab from the left to go into the relay assignment function menu. Anytime you see a check mark next to a parameter or function, that means that is currently active. So to change your assignments for these relays, enter on each and you can go into your assignment and change them according to your preference such as a run status or a fault status. You can also go ahead and adjust your delay time for activation as well as holding time in these particular menus. And same deal with your other relays. You can go into each relay, change your assignment and change your delay time if necessary. And this is how you program the ATV 630 and 930 drives to enable the relay functions.